Your your flat crew. They're my favorite crew. I mean, who who wouldn't love flak for a crew? Flak running around on your ship for your crew. Shame Ran didn't encounter the new four power laser. Maybe you'll see it in the enemy ship mod. Uh, let's see here. I think the last one he hasn't played is the one that starts only two flak crew and basically bare bone system levels, but you got four flak ones to start, so you don't need to find flaks in stores. Is that the one? I thought I played the one that started with four flax. Um Let me see. Was this the one I first played? Because they all three have the artilleries, right? Um. <laughs> we did the boarding flak last time, which was a lot of fun. Um. They are basically the same ship. But I wanted to play the last one. I thought maybe it was this one that I haven't played. I mean, if we play this one, this will be a fast run. Do you remember for sure, Math Champ? Do I need to look it up? I played A first, then C. All right. So I haven't played this one? Well, good. I'd love to play a full flackening starting in Sector 1. <laughs> hmm? And that's what it's called. It's called the flackening. The flak version. The flak. <clears throat> <clears throat> one second. <clears throat> Goodness. Too excited. Um, your, um, your flackening name cracked me up because I wasn't expecting to start a ship that actually starts as a flackening. Catch it. <clears throat> you need to get the scrap to upgrade your systems, right? Very low systems. I hope the power is not super low. Um, no power is good. Fall the rebellion! <laughs> You did do goods for the flax, okay. Couldn't remember. <laughs> I love that the flax are sitting on top of the um, little red parts that light up. Yeah, I guess this is a little challenging early because flax by themselves will be a little weak to um, like auto scouts and stuff. Need the three auto reloaders to make it a true flackening, that's right. Not a true flackening, unless we get auto reloaders. And of course, I say auto scout against flak. Why do we fight first ship? Frickin' FTL, man. Frickin' FTL. Okay. Ah, didn't even matter. <clears throat> Whoa, but we hit both systems. Get wrecked. Uh, jump image is missing? No, it's not a jump image missing. It's because the fact that this ship... The ship is actually a giant weapon. The way to have the entire... Um, ship... Function as a... You see how it did the animations? Because the ship itself is actually a weapon. Rad 82 was the first one I saw do this. And it blew my mind the first time I saw it. At least it wasn't a beam drone. Um, I think beam drone would have been better, right? As long as that he doesn't eye on my shields, but it's fine. We're fine, we're fine. Okay, so first thing we need is we need engines and power. Then we go shields, then we start upgrading our weapons. That's probably how we're gonna do this. Yeah, and I think one thing that I never noticed before I saw ships like this was that um, when you jump, your ships must disappear. I hear ships. Your weapons must disappear when you jump. And I never really noticed that until we played these weapon ships that, uh, oh god, that's a repair drone. That uh, the entire ship disappears. I don't think I'm going to stop him. At least, man, he's got a value point in shields. I'm so surprised. This is my, I'm surprised that he's got a value point in Sector 1 space. Right as it goes by. All right. Well, at least it wasn't a lose a jump, but that's dumb. 
You notice on Rad 82's that he still included a translucent hole image so that the ship didn't completely disappear. Oh, did he really? Okay. If I delay them a bit, how the hell was I going to delay them, man? I, I, <sighs> the only good room to shoot was shields. Maybe the empty room between shields and the left room would have been better to hope it hit multiple rooms. I don't know. I was just, just FTL. Almost wish you thought of that for the drudge mauler you made, but that big cannon doesn't really make animations when shooting itself. Yeah. The only ships I've seen have animations when they... When artillery goes off are these ones that are... Well, I take that back. Didn't you do one? Oh my god. Oh my god. They hit weapons and shields. I might just restart this fucking run right here. Weapons and shields. The two best systems to hit. Didn't you have one that was like some big artillery with something like a federation thing in the middle or something? Perfect goddamn swipe, man. Oh, thank god it almost hit it almost hit my weapons again. Okay, screw you, man. What a terrible start. My RNG is not as bad as the previous run. But it's close, and I hear fires. In here somewhere. You did a fed ship a fed ship with a big iron artillery and had the lights running along the hull, yeah. Is either you or Scottish Pingu that did that, so you you had that, and I was I always thought that was really cool. In that case, you only trimmed out the whole image where you needed to. Nice. Alright, so now we can get power and then we can work on shields next. Um, I don't think this gets us an actual extra jump. All right, so I got a question for you people, you other gamers out there. Shogi was telling me about this game. You have no missiles to sell. Uh, Genshin Impact. That's a free-to-play game that people have been playing. Has anybody here been playing that? Is that any good? You compared it to, like, Breath of the Wild, the Zelda game. Like a free-to-play Breath of the Wild. Um that you can play with other people, you can co-op or something. Is it any, has anybody here played it? Is it any good? I downloaded it last night, but I haven't played it. I was interested in possibly checking it out. Could you maybe not hit the two best systems with every shot? Maybe? Maybe? No. Too much to ask. Jesus, man. Frickin' hell. Thank you. No more weapons for you, you douchebag. You douchebag. You jackass. You've heard of it, but never played it. You don't mind the game, but unless you're doing it wrong, it got super grindy fast. Uh, you're not sure you agree with the Breath of the Wild comparison, aside from gliding and climbing. Combat is different. Okay. I never played Breath of the Wild, so I wouldn't know if it's similar or not. Um... You stay super far away from free-to-play games, they are usually money pits. Well, I mean, the best one I can think of is, uh... Uh, PoE, Path of Exile. And I spent some money on it, but to me it's not a money pit. Uh, you've seen some gameplay, not your type, but it seems okay if you're into RPGs. Yeah, I watched a little bit this morning just to see the gameplay. I'm not sure it's gonna be for me either, but I might give it a try just to see it be like a fun thing to do when I'm not streaming and bored out of my mind. That's how free-to-play games are like. They're just always grindy. Hey, we lost it. We didn't lose a jump, but we lost a ship and now we lose a jump. So thanks FTL. Thanks. We'll shoot here and hope we get missile offline. Really grind if you don't dump your money into the fire. Okay. All right. I, again, could I not have every single shot hit one of the two most important systems every goddamn time? And he dodged my entire volley. Oh, thank you. My artillery is off. That's mis that's a misplay by me. But it's just it's just stupid missiles. Stupid missiles being stupid and imbalanced because they're stupid and stupid and stupid and stupid All right, well value point and shield keep me alive here Yeah, it, it didn't matter if I turned it just doesn't matter. They have a missile 
Look at all these empty rooms they've hit, everybody. Look at how lucky I am right now. All of my offense and my defense is offline. God damn it, I hate this game so much. I really hate this game. You're trying to figure out why your PC struggles when it's running. Uh, wait, what? Someone also mentioned it has a pretty invasive anti-cheat software. Genshin is fun for you. They call me Hayes. You don't really need to spend money to be able to do anything. It just gets you access to more OP characters. Okay. Can you run out of missiles for the love of God? No, no. You have infinite missiles. Good to know. Good to know that you have infinite missiles. Right as he runs out of missiles, that's when I get his weapons offline. Cool. I don't even know where these fires are. They're probably all around here. Get that shit out of here. S stupid bullshit fight. Fucking five health because of one goddamn missile. OP weaponism dead in Sector 1. I mean, it's not OP if you can't use it. You know what's OP in Sector 1? A single goddamn missile. That's what's OP in this stupid game. For the enemy, anyway. Against a flak who's trying to shoot a ship with shields and weapons on the edge of the ship without being a big system. Hashtag balanced FTL. Hashtag balanced. Uh, they shot the RD system like five times now. They really don't want it online, yeah. This is kind of how you set up the ship. It's really fragile to start until you can scale up the systems a bit. Well, it wouldn't be so bad if, you know, missiles weren't the stupidest, most imbalanced thing in the universe and galaxy of FTL. All right, I need seven more scrap and I'm gonna have two shields and it won't be quite so fragile. You know, we're about to restart anyway. All right, screw you, FTL. Screw you and the horse you rode in on. Compared to the A configuration where you had the extra crew and system levels, we have to fight in the flax for your flackening now. Hey, how about another layout that completely screws us? Cool. They're in my O2. That will put them in the heel bay. It's like they know I have flax. It's like they know. All right, well, at least it wasn't my weapons or shields, thank God. I'm pretty sure there are layouts of this ship that have weapons and shields not in little tiny rooms off to the side. I th I'm pretty sure that exists. I think there's a fire here. Nope. Pretty sure there's actually an exact layout where shields are here and weapons are here in four slot rooms. Can I run into that layout, please? Maybe, game? Maybe. Nope, I meant to go in the heal bay, not the weapon room. Ah. Uh. You know, I've had a bad day yesterday. Well, not a bad day, but a long, tiring day yesterday when I'm, like, this salty this early on all my FTL runs. Or I just haven't been getting bad luck in FTL lately, so this is all my salt saved up that's all spewing out right now. I'm gonna try to be a hero. Hey, frickin' four tile rooms with shields and weapons. Thank God. Only if it isn't pirate, your unbalanced mod changes that. Are you talking about the layout of something when you say that, Red? Let's turn on auto fire here. <clears throat> You're gonna, go, you're gonna go to get bed because you're also exhausted. All right, Fufa Force. Well, have a good night. Have a good night, my friend. Thanks for hanging out. Sleep well, my friend. Stay thirsty, my friend.
Layouts are different for pirates in your mod. Okay. Double reward? Hey, it's a repair for free when I haven't taken any damage. Thanks. Thanks, FTL. The most trolly double reward we can get. Free repair when I am full health. Cool. And I didn't get that last run when I was, you know, down to like no health. Because that would have been a good time to get it. Because that would be not trolly. And FTL doesn't do not trolly things. <clears throat> that would have been nice last run when we were down to five hole. It sure would have. Sure would have. I think my favorite thing about the Dumble Dodge emo is like his, the way his eyes are like looking a little bit sideways. <laughs> He's like, what? What? <laughs> I'm just a Dumble Doge. Just Dumble Doge and the things. Haven't, we haven't really admired Dumble Doge enough lately, I feel like. Oh, I hit the, the auto fire button. Do, 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 do. Five fuel, no thanks. What do you mean I don't have enough flak? It's a great question. Which is cheaper? So 60 versus 50. All right, so shields are slightly cheaper to get online. I wonder if it'd be better to invest in the second flak first. Since we have the artillery, it's probably not better. Um, how many distress beacons could we actually do with what we have here? We don't have an NG for blue options. Plaque, I don't know, gives you anything for distress beacon. Uh, very many distress beacons. We just go one, two, three, four, five. Get some extra jumps over here. Yeah, no clone bay. Don't have a lot of the things we'd want to actually be able to have a successful thing. Wow, a missile and a two-shot laser. Well, I sure hope you don't hit my shields and weapons with your first shot. Hey, we dodged, but he hit my weapons. I am so surprised. <clears throat> Weapon shot number two? No. No, just my engines being on fire. Okay. Guess it's good. At least it's good venting on this ship. Oh, God. Oh, I thought we were not even going to vent it in time. All right, we didn't hit my artillery. Come on, come on, come on. Do, 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 do. Reach. <laughs> wow, what a what an OP artillery with 15 shots. So OP. As we do like three damage with that. <laughs> Jesus. Do I have another breach? I must have another breach. Okay, we need to figure out where it is. Is in here? Oh, right next door. Okay. How long do you get banned for if you suggest selling some flax at the store? You don't get banned. You only get banned for like racist and other stuff that's actually bannable. <laughs> I was actually thinking about that. I was thinking I might need to sell a flax to get like shields online or something earlier. Because how weak this ship is early. Weak? It has four flax. Yeah, but it's intentionally weak because of that. What if you're racist against flax, Kappa? <laughs> That's a bannable offense. Suggesting selling, you know, that's just, that's just a thing. But being racist against flax, we don't accept that around here. We don't take kindly to your kind around these parts, kindly, kindly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. All right, Nebulas, what you gonna do when we come for you, bad boys? Bad boys, bad boys. Okay, so what's the timing on this? Perfectly timed to get wrecked. <laughs> it's right. Perfectly timed. Depower my shield. Let that through. It's punishable by permaban to be. Yes, to be uh, racist against flax. What is the ability of the flax dudes? Um, it does system damage and crew damage. Uh, no, uh, actually, I think it just does hull damage. It's like a doing a shot. 
like a flak shot to that room inside the room, I think. Oof, okay, that's a really nice reward. But you can't do it on your own ship because it damages your ship. I don't know how Math Champ made it so that you can't actually do it on your own ship. What if you are racist by saying flat crew best race, flak supremacy? That is encouraged. <laughs> uh, no, actually, I should probably should, should, shouldn't even joke about that. Make flacketing great again. <laughs> oh god, jeez. Oh, All right, let's not let's not get a little close to political stuff here. Okay, it wasn't my weapons or shields. How did that do damage, but not? Okay, whatever. It must have hit this room. Okay, freaking two damage missile. Get that crap out of here. Good. You mother flacker. Whoa! Whoa! Hey, wow, that one actually did work. Is that a breach? That's a breach. Flacker, but I just, I hardly know her. That's right, that's right. Flacker, I hardly know her. Is it better to max out artillery or to get weapon power? Uh, do you even have to ask? Guess which one of these I can aim. These. Besides, it's, it's... It'd be 80, 80 scrap to even get it to 30 second cooldown, which is still three times longer than the flax. It's 100% better to get the weapons online first. 100%. 100, 110%. 100. Okay, so we need power. So we can do this and have artillery online. Which, which one one-shots? Um, neither of them. I'm pretty sure there's not a ship that we would fight that this would one-shot in this game. Have you seen the accuracy of this thing? Nice! Beautiful. I want you in... Um, let's see. How many dodges have you got? I really don't want you in weapons, so I think what I'm actually going to do is this. You hope the flak has a large negative cell value. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Three Zoltan, best Zoltan. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. If we want to store, we'll have to decide. Well, let's go. You just opened the stream. I was listening for a good five minutes. Just notice how this, sh how now what this ship is. Yes. Okay. He can't get through my shields, but asteroid field would make that possible. So. All right. Nice. Nice. Way to go, Asteroid Field. Thanks for helping out. Asteroid Field's a bro. Whew, you're dead. You, sir, are dead. Ooh. So 60 scrap to get the next flak online. So that's what we're going to save up for next. One, two, three, four. Do I even want double distress? I think Zoltan can overcharge something for possibly a blue option. I couldn't do giant alien spiders. We'll go distresses. You swap clone bay for it to be renewable energy. That's right. Doc, try to rescue survivors. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. So stinking good. All right. You back to there. You to there. That is two free crew sector one. That is huge, man. That is huge. Uh, rewarded for going to distress. Please don't kill this crew. Eh, they're just pirates. Nice. Two distress beacons that we could actually do without blue options. Okay, you have a missile. Three people can fight? Yeah, actually, I mean, two mantis and... I mean, two flak and mantis. Flaks are even better than mantis at fighting, I'm pretty sure. Well, come on. On single missile double fire. Oh god, don't. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. And he hit the door, so I can't even. 
I'm now in an asteroid field with no shields. Come on, game. Just give me a fucking break with this right now. My Even my doors are on fire. What the hell? Two missiles, two f fucking fires, man. Actually, it's probably more fires than that. Oh my god. And his missile's back online, because F you, FTL, F you, you piece of shit. His run was going so well. So goddamn well. Goddamn Lido missile just caused fucking um, all the fires. Stupid shitty game, man. Get me the fuck out of here. Alright, we need to repair our doors so that we can put these fires out. With, um, venting here. Man, I'm trying not to be salty. I tell you, it is... I, I'm telling you guys. Not being salty in FTL for me is like... My... Achilles heel. I just... I can't not be salty at this stupid, frustrating, fun, but infuriating game. How the hell do you get... Do you roll double fires with a single damage missile that often? It's just, how was that shit random, man? How was that random? You grown? Yeah, I don't know what that means. I, 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 I'm not. I play video games all day. I'm not grown. I think I'm a grown-ass man. i a grown-ass man. Streams for a living. I'm not a real grown-ass man. I'm a little boy in a man's body. Even the flat can have a bad day? What's up, pie boy? It's deliberately screwing me. All day. All day. That is, though, enough scrap to get our second flak online. There's a store. I'm not going to do it yet because... Oh, if I was going to do abandon, it would be now. Do I want NG controlled right now? I don't want a bunch of stores. Actually, I mean, I need to repair. I do have the whole laser 2 to sell. I think we go to NG, because we need an easy sector to, like, kind of recover and repair and upgrade here. Fortune with a thousand bits! <laughs> Never grow up, Rand. I'll do my best. Doing my best. Banner sectors are absolute trash. Just, the borders just kill runs. Not on Sector 2. Sector 2 is the best time to go to abandon Sector. Because you, they cannot roll uh, Lanius Bombers on Sector 2. Okay. So, if you're gonna go to Abandoned Sector, do it Sector 2. Nope. 1, 2. Power. Actually, I think I don't get power and I get backup battery repairs here. Now we are looking good. Now we're looking good. One more flak does the body good. I kind of wanted just the the uh, the Angie so I could get an early store. More likely to get an early store because we just took so much damage. And the last basically two fights, I think. Alright, you're in my heal, babe. That's great. Uh, there. Some good events in abandoned, plus Lenya scouts tend to be fairly weak. Yeah, it was it was definitely a viable option to go abandoned sector two. I was thinking about it, but just because of where our health was at. I wanted a higher chance to get a store early just to heal. Now that we got two flax, now even auto scouts we should be pretty darn strong against. Did he get over? I don't think he actually got over. Yeah, I don't hear him attacking. Okay. All right, so now we need power. Okay. Do this. We can back up better at Doge's. And then we either work towards our next flak or missile defense now. We'll have to see which we want to go. Oh, okay. That's the Agent Smith if we had a human. It's okay. I'll take free scrappage. Robert Smith, whatever his name is. Um, we can get cloaking and hacking, so saving up for cloaking is really expensive. Abandoned Sector 8. Best sector. <laughs> 
Oh, I said I'd be okay with uh, with uh, auto scouts. I didn't mean an auto hacker with hacking and a missile. Please don't hack my weapons, shields, or piloting, please. All right. Well, shield is probably the best of those three to hack, since you only have a basic laser. Please don't missile my weapons, please. Oh my God, he might just die. Oh, I fucking hate this game. Look at that. Two shots, fucking three fires. Thank God. Just F you, FTL. Just F you. That's the second time a single missile's caused a double fire in my shields. In the last, like, five jumps, I think. God damn it. Why, do you, why are you such a piece of crap, FTL? Why, why do you treat people this way? This is why you don't have friends. This is why you don't have friends, FTL. It just caused an extra damage because the fire spread. So fucking stupid, man. This has been my RNG all day today. It has been so frustrating. It's just all the punishment all the time. Daniel Powder, bad day starts. Is that the, you had a bad day? Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da, then turn it around. Is that is that that song? Okay. <laughs> yes, that is a theme song for today's FTL runs. Apparently, Daniel Powder's "Bad Day." Although that's a very happy sounding song for a song about having a bad day, but I guess he talks about turning it around. So maybe it's about having a good day after a bad day. I don't know. Stress speaking. Nope, we need another store to repair, I guess. Rand should make an FTL-themed parody. Kappa. Just remove the turn it around and it makes sense. For FTL, that's right. Four damage for nine scrap? Probably not worth. Watch this part of the stream get copyrighted, though. Well, I think I did it for less than five seconds. I think as long as it's not more than five seconds, I'm okay. But that would really suck. It might happen, though. And I think just singing it a cappella wouldn't cause that to happen as well. I'm hoping. Again, I don't know all the rules for that, but I don't think me just singing that would get it. Would get DMCA striked. God, I hope not anyway. Good dodge. First laser to a mini beam. Meet my double flex. Oh, God. He's still charging. My singing was so good that they couldn't differentiate it from the real song. Okay. No store, so we want to go one, two, three, four. Open for a store there for repairs. That's what I think I want to do. I don't have missile defense, I just gotta go dodge. I just gotta go dodge like this. Anti-personnel drone, okay, something to sell, I like that, I like free stuff, oh, I don't like free fire damage though, oh, and I don't like missiles, uh, please don't do another miss single missile double, fi double file, please, please don't do that, okay, we'll give you, how about a single missile single fire, god fucking damn it, man, Every single missile. Did you change the missiles to have higher fire chance? You didn't, did you? Scottish Pingu, I don't think you did. I don't think you did, but it sure feels like you did. That's my heal be on fire. Okay. Oh wait, no, this is math championship. I keep I was asking. Scottish Pingu all the stuff last time. Yeah, you didn't do that. It's just, it's just, just lucky, just lucky, I guess. I don't think I hear any other fires. Yeah, it seems okay. Well, no store unless we have to dive one here for a store. You didn't touch the vanilla weapons. Are you sure you didn't change a random value by accident? And what about Dumbledoge mod? No, well, it's free stuff. 
Oh, man. I have two things to sell. But if I do that, I dive. What if exit beacon store, though? Then I wouldn't have to dive for it. It'd be funny sneaking a missile buff into Dumbledore or Gib Tester of the music mod. Funny? That would be just the meanest thing you could possibly do. Ah, do I dive for a store to repair? Seems so anti... I don't know. Anti-something. Um, working against yourself. Because if I do that to repair... Then I have to repair the tam damage we take in the dive, and we could just die in the dive. So, let's go NG Homeworlds. Counterintuitive, yeah. that's. I think that's what I was trying to say. Counterintuitive. I don't know if that makes sense, but I think that is what I was thinking of. Thank you all for reading my mind. Appreciate that. Uh... Okay, we're looking for a store to heal or free repairs. You will neither confirm nor deny that there is something up with the music mod. There isn't. <laughs> Ignore it's a tarp. Store. Thank you. Counterproductive. That's the one. Diving to repair the store is counterproductive. That's the one. Long range scanners and hacking. This is a great store that I'm not going to be able to afford very much. I could get exactly hacking or I could get long range scanners and repair. I really want hacking, but we're getting the long range scanners because that's too good. Repair and all the fuel. All right. Five. Okay. Uh, you already sent you. You already sent me your missile troll mod ages ago. Yes, you did. And I have purposefully not played it. <laughs> I remember. I see it every time I load up my spreadsheet of ships and go, all right, there's that missile mod. Make sure I never play that one. Okay, let's move on to the next mod. Okay, reactor upgrade. All right. I do have the drone to sell. And I'm going to need to immediately buy more fuel, apparently. There's cloaking we can't afford. And an NG could almost afford. One, two, three. What if I give you a ship with all the missile defense in the world? Then sure, I'll play it. If I have a ship that's... Oh my god. If I have a ship that's made to counter that, sure. This is this is an insane build because this, these two weapons time out perfectly. And he has cloaking and two shields. And this is what, sector three? Oh, God, okay. Jesus Christ, man. Alright, well, at least we dodged a shot. I don't know what his repairs look like, so... Uh, let's get his cloaking, please. Okay, didn't hit my weapons, thank you. Okay, good. Impressed I didn't lose another HP there? Well, that's just luck. That's... I cannot take any credit. It's doges. Ugh. Artillery, even when it's a 15 damage flak, is still a completely goddamn worthless system. Countered by cloaking because of perfect timing. Completely worthless system, man. <sighs> hey, we dodged something. Okay, let's wait for the cloak. There we go. Why did you go? I didn't click you to go there. Did I? Sure didn't mean to. Please, for the love of God, finish this fight. Double resist. Come on, FTL. Why are you such a... Mm. 
Double fuck. Yeah, you know, you should have rock hole plating with cloaking, five weapon power, all the shields. You know what? You should just have everything. You should have everything. You should go fight the boss because apparently you're stronger than I am. Jesus Christ. Let's get that ship to go fight the boss because I sure the fuck can't. Well, this how this run is going. And I am more angry than I should be right now. But my God, this game is stupid, man. This game is stupid. Oh, it's being a bastard today. God, FTL is so kicking my ass with the RNG. I swear. Ah, uh, what do I even do? Do I go back to the store to heal? So freaking inefficient to do that. Ah, oh my god. You're gonna make that into a player ship? The ship that I just fought? Okay. Yeah, okay, alright. Free borders. It's, you know, normal. With a glade beam and ion. You know, why, why, why shouldn't they have that? And you fucking fall. Are you goddamn kidding me with this shit right now? Are you goddamn kidding me that you actually follow me into this room? Glaive beam plus ion. Good dodge. Can we get it offline? Good. My mantis is losing this fight. I need to go over here. You know, they should have free borders. They should, again, they should have all the stuff. Oh, I didn't even get there in time to stop it. Cool. One extra damage from boarding. Fun times. Oh, Jesus. Don't you fucking die, man. Holy crap. This fucking game right now. Again, excuse my language, but goddamn mother effer. Am I just getting every event that can screw me over and over and it just screws me over and over? That's what it feels like. Now bad days being played outside my window with a boom box. <laughs> uh, oh my god. I've already spent a bunch of scrap on repairs too. That's I think another reason why I feel so far behind. What are the flat crew members there? They're a thing that uh, Matt Champ created. Should be lots of fun if I wasn't getting anal raped for this entire run. I'd be having a blast with them. Sorry, sorry, sorry I said that. It's just what it feels like right now. Oh, free borders! You shouldn't have. You freaking shouldn't have, FTL. I was wondering when these would get here. This is the same event. We just got it twice in a row. This ship actually probably does more damage to us because we uh, got the uh, glaive beam offline before it could fire last time. A lineup for anal probings this FTL Monday. <laughs> yes, that's right. It's anal probing day. I mean, FTL viewership day. Remember five years ago, the FU meme? Move aside. Rand is taking your place. <laughs> oh, God. I think that guy actually did do one damage, and we didn't take any damage from the Glaive Beam one as much as I whined about it. All right. So, 125 to get third flak. Maybe third flak would make me strong enough. No, I think I need I need defense. So I need cloaking. Basically, I need cloaking. We are getting close to being able to support uh, to support to uh, purchase cloaking. Oh god, boarding drone. Am I gonna allow that? Uh, no. Thank you. 
I need to hit multiple systems to pull the pilot off. Because shooting at the piling is the absolute worst thing to shoot at on this ship. For flat, for double flax. Did that pull the pilot yet? No. I can't let him run. There it is. Got him. And second breach. Cool. All right, we should kill him before this should be a problem, though. Get wrecked. Okay. Yeah, you don't repair that in time because you're a crappy Zoltan who can't do who can't do anything. No, who just has too low health. Order three times in a row. Well, that one wasn't nearly as bad. Especially because the rooms he went in weren't important rooms. It's funny that the already at level 1 is just barely too slow to hit a ship that runs from the start of the fight. Funny? Sounds like, um, calculated to me. It's calculated to, sh to show what the devs think of players actually not getting screwed in this game. A banner is old in home worlds. Wow, okay. I mean, Zoltan Shield will be amazing, but you know, it's also amazing getting killed in the Zoltan sector. If FTL didn't clearly, if FTL didn't clearly hate you, three borders and NG homeworlds. No. I am, um, okay, so we want empty jumps, but I also want cloaking right now, and I have nothing to sell, so I want to get as much scrap before this store as I can. What's up, Rudy Van Winkler? It's good to see you, my friend. How are you doing? Feel like it's been a minute. Nice, this guy can't do damage. Yes, a ship that can't kill me! Ah, I'm so surprised and amazed and happy. It's the abandoned hope world. <laughs> you're good, you're good. What's up, Lazaroon? Hope I'm doing fine. Today has been a rough day, I'll tell you. It's been a salty day in, in Rand Land, that's for sure. I haven't taken a break. I think that's one thing. I haven't taken a break for a while. I think I might need to take a day or two off coming up in the next couple of weeks. Because I've been uh, streaming a lot and getting tired. You ever work so much or so hard that you, when you actually have a day off, you can't relax and you can't think of a way to actually wind down. That's kind of where I'm at right now. It's beautiful being able to auto-fire at whatever you want and relaxing. It is nice. Three shields and a missile. And boarding. This ship would be not bad except for this one piece of shit right here. This ship I'd be fine with except for the one goddamn missile. And the million percent dodge that he has, you know, that's that's the other thing. Uh, let's get one more shot off here. Oh, actually, he gets double damage from shooting him, I think. Yes! Get that missile out of here. Frickin' two damage piece of crap. What, can I, what I can't imagine is relaxing, meaning staying away from video games. Yeah. Well, and that's the thing. It's like when I don't have, you know... Some other thing that I'm really into, whether it's a game or a show or hanging out with real life people, you know, there's like just, you know, all the COVID social distancing, making it so that even if I wanted to go out and do something, I really can't. But when I'm home, I, I'm just, I'm bored, can't think of anything to do. And so I end up working on stream stuff offline, and I'm just like, oh my god. Oh, critical, you don't say, game. I wonder why. <laughs> uh, it's the only ship you could beat the boss without buying a single extra item. Uh, F Fed B, you're saying, is S tier. Okay. Alright, well, I can't afford cloaking, and if I get one more ship fight with a missile, I probably die. So we're gonna look for cloaking. If it's not there, we repair a bunch. Is there another ship that can beat the boss with its original beat the boss with its original loadout? Um I don't know. 
No cloaking. It does have hacking, though. So we'd probably go hacking repairs here. Kind of a missile defense. Oh, there's all my scrap. Oh, there we go. And now we want empty jumps because we're looking for Zoltan's shield here. That's a dead end. Okay. So that thing is COVID hasn't changed anything in your life. It hasn't changed that much for me to me, me either, Lazarone. That's how scuffed my uh, social life is. Non-existent, basically. Three, four, five, six. Actually, that's pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, Fed B does have the dual lasers plus Leto to get through phase three Zoltan shields. Already beam rocks. Already beam does not rock. You all do not understand this game if you think there's it. Already beam is good. Double defense drone. Okay. Already beam is not good. Ignores all shields that you can't aim that could do one damage for 200 scrap investment. Yeah, great. It's not good. It's not good. It is worse than every other system that could be in its place except maybe teleporter depending on your crew. Uh, nope. I would want every other system than artillery in its slot. One, two, three, four, five. I feel like I'm being less, um... Well, there's this vo viewpoint, there's this viewpoint. I'm just like, this is just bad. It's bad and it should feel bad. <laughs> Stop making, trying to make artillery good. It's not good. All right, do I keep saving up for cloaking or do we go for the f next flak online? We'll see, I guess. There are niche, niche situations where artillery can fill a void, that void being actually something useful. But you would always rather have that actually something useful than the artillery. At least I would. Uh, only achieve that bloodshed and can I please not get a... Envoy, there we go. There we go. There's our missile defense. Okay. I think we go for our next flak online now. Or our artillery. I mean, our, our hacking. Um, probably go for the flak. How many rounds of FTL have I played in total? There's no possible way I could even begin to estimate that. I don't even know how many hours I have in the game because Steam does not record them correctly for me with Slipstream Mod Manager. Hundreds, thousands, I don't know. I couldn't begin to guess. I'd have to try to do some serious, like, mathing to try to estimate how many runs I've done a week since I've started streaming FTL, figuring out when exactly I did start streaming FTL, then estimate how many I did before I started streaming FTL. I just, there's... There's no way I could give a good honest guess there. Wow. S screwed me. Okay. Wow, the perfect amount of dodges. Um, let's let's hack your shields. Could you could you give my could you give my Zoltan a break, man? And of course he repairs cloak right as I hack. Could not be any shittier right now. Please don't he has hit my fucking shields 20,000 times. Give me a break. Please don't hit my shields again. That kills my Zoltan. Look at the bright side, Randy. Didn't hit your weapons. You know what I haven't done? I haven't hit his weapons either because I fucking can't because of where they are. Oh my god. Oh my god. Perfectly timed cloak. Okay, go heal. I don't want to lose you. Because this stupid, shitty game that is frustrating the hell out of me. Yeah, you know, I shouldn't have shields, really. It's unfair 
that I get to have something that you have. It really is unfair. It's, it's really unfair that shields should stay online for me, really. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's good that you're doing this. That's a really good deal, and I really don't want to take it because fuck this guy, but I'm taking it. Christ almighty, this run is day of FTL. Everyone knows why this channel comes with an advisory warning? Yes. Everyone always asks, Rand, why is this a mature stream? Have you seen my FTL streams? Have you? Because if you haven't, then you don't know why. Now you know why. Goddamn game. And it's the only game I play now that makes me like this. I used to play Smite, and I was as salty or more in Smite. You know now why I don't play Smite anymore. Because I cannot handle the saltiness. Can I can barely handle it for FTL. I don't even know if you could call this handling it. It's just a game. Why do you have to be so mad? F-bomb mark two. That's right. That's my that's my weapon that I always have equipped. The F-bomb mark two. The F-bomb mark two. All right, what do we got? Zoltan control. Jeez. Are Flak Boys a skin or are they a custom race? They're a custom race. Ready by Math Champ. All right, can I do this? Yes, I can. We're doing this. We're going to start um, hacking, piloting, and flacking their faces off. Flacking their effing. Flacking their flacking faces off. That's what we're going to be doing here. I do need power, though. We, are, we, we have a high chance of dying in this Zoltan sector. Get a single Zoltan, um... Zoltan bomber, or... What you call it? Uh, border police, we're pretty screwed. And make sure you have the only thing that can get through my Zoltan shield without us being able to dodge immediately. Make sure you have that. We will, we will flack you. That's right. Finally, the ship is online. The three flax is kind of what you need for this late in sectors to actually get through shields. Okay, what is that? Pulsar, I need shields now and I need cloaking. You have to play some Apex? All right, well, thanks for hanging out and stopping by, my friend. Have a good one, Rudy Van Winkler. It was good to see you for a bit. No, I'm not going to get power. We need to save up for stuff. Another one bites the flak. <laughs> uh, mind control. <sighs> he doesn't have cloaking. That's the only reason I'm considering this fight. Mind control kind of screws me, though, so just give me free stuff. I'll take it. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, yeah. Double missile weapons. So hashtag balanced. All right. So we either three shot them or we get destroyed. We actually... I really wish our first attempt on this was the one we kept, because I think we got more crew, right? Didn't we get more free crew on our first attempt on this? Maybe that was a different run that I'm getting mixed up with. Is there such a thing as balanced in FTL? Not really, <laughs> honestly. But there is such a thing as more imbalanced. Or more punishing. Um, which I would describe as Captain's Edition, some of those other mods. First attempt, we just got completely destroyed. Oh, God. Okay. If he bombs this room, um, I might just lose crew here. Free borders. Oh, my God. How many borders are we about to get boarded with? That was... Okay, that was three. And he's going to send more over here. Is that right? I did not select both of you. I only selected the Zoltan. I 
I actually don't know. If I could do this here. Make sure you don't... I only selected one guy. I swear it's selecting multiple people when I select one person. Is there, is there something wrong with my mouse or something that this keeps happening? Because I have my shields or... Heal bay or whatever. Okay. Alright, no weapons. We got the... Got the missile offline just in time, I believe. Get wrecked. Okay, good. I should hack the teleporter. Um, maybe. I often don't do that because if your micro is good enough, with especially with pause, you can often handle borders without having to do something like that. And I'd rather hack engines, piloting, or shields or weapons. It's usually my preference. Okay, so I could get third shield. I wouldn't have the power for it. And to be able to do that and use hacking. Um, Zolt controlled sector. I think I still should do this though. Backup battery to level one hacking for now. Hope we don't run into big giant missiles. Sticky clicker drags the selection box. I don't know what sticky clicker is. Yes! That could have been bad, but it was good. It was better than bad, it was good. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, one, two, three, four. Mm. Five, six, seven, eight. I guess something like that's probably our best shot. Mouse key that does not release fast enough. I mean, I have a Logitech G502. It's a really nice mouse. I don't know. Maybe I need to clean it out. Too much, too many cookie crumbs in it or something. Thank you for not being built and boarding on me. I appreciate that. Okay. All right. I should probably get doors. We're getting boarded so much. Zelden sector apparently is also a mantis sector. We've been just, we've been learning lately. So they just always have a million borders. All right. We are safe. Safe from harm. Safe from safe and sound. Safe and sound. All right. Get demonetized for that too, I guess. This guy cannot do damage to us. It's like only the second ship this entire run, I feel like. Yeah, the uh, flak are kind of like super rockmen, I guess. Good description of them. All right, we need cloaking. Cloaking is our next buy. Hopefully, and that's the goal anyway. Hacking upgrade could be not bad too. Ooh, there's a lot of good ship jumps or potential ship jumps. One, two, three, four, possibly five, six, if we want to dive. What does the ability on Flakman do? It only works on enemy ships and it uh, does damage to their to the room. It, uh, it's like a flak hitting that room, I believe. Math Champ can clarify for certain, but it's something like that. Wow, we both got through our, the Zoltan Shield on the first shot. I'm more surprised with him, but I guess it shouldn't be surprising with a freaking Beam Drone Mark II deleting my Zoltan Shield. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna, we wanna go one, two, is this a nebula? It's not a nebula, one, two, three, four. We couldn't go one, two, three, four, five without diving. What if I went one, two, three, four, and one of these was a store, I might dive for that store. Now that I have Zoltan Shield, if I had enough for cloaking, I would do it. They must have dumb champ on pass, otherwise how would they be able to get on a ship and kill us off the path? Shut up. 
Hey, what do you know? Another beam drone so that my Zolden Shield basically doesn't exist. Cool. Cool. They must have Zolden Shield bypass and they must own every drone that can get through Zolden Shield instantly. Otherwise, how else would they cheat and screw us over and fucking over? I'm not bitter, people. I'm not bitter at all about FTL. Not at all. Every ship I find something to complain about. And I wonder why I don't have more viewers. <laughs> it's so negative all the time. Jesus. Oh, I really need to be more positive. I need to learn how to be more positive. I swear. All right, die, sir. Thank you. Uh, now bad day is right next to you with a 60-inch subwoofer. <laughs> oh, man. It'd be fine if they just really have Zold and Shield bypass and transport it because that would mean they're using up their crew and stuff, but no, yeah. It's just they put the flavor text because that event never fails to get free crew on your ship. They just have to put that because otherwise, how would they do that? It couldn't be subset and... You know, FTL just screwing you. It couldn't be that. It has to be a logical explanation for this. There actually is a store there. Okay. Just means I have Le Passion. That's right. That's what Burger says. That's what Burger says anyway. Uh, okay, so you have all your stuff online. Uh, let's just go right for the weapons. Let me get those offline. We should be pretty safe. Oh, okay. And he's running. I am so surprised by that right now. No surrender. You go to hell and you die. You go to hell. You go to hell. You die. Uh, it would be. F uh, let's see. These enemies holding borders do not miss your power moving around. Well, I mean, it wouldn't be bad if they like gave power to the room that they were in. Because then it would just be excess power in the ship. But yeah, you're right that if they actually took power out of the room... There's no way that would ever be balanced, I feel like. God, we're like 16 scraps short of cloaking. I'd have to sell... I do have FTL Jammer, okay. Alright, FTL, make up for all the shit. And have cloaking at this store that I can sell my FTL Jammer, jammer for. Please. Please. Please, page 2, cloaking. Alright, well, I guess we repair that. Oh, I would have been one scrap short anyway. Oh, that would have made me super salty anyway. One scrap short. Okay, well, we're not diving this sector. We still have two more sectors to find cloaking, so we're just gonna repair. I would have been one scrap shy. Do I remember Pew Pew Ship? Unusual name tag. Uh, maybe? I don't know. Probably not, honestly. It's hard for me to rec uh, remember individual ships unless they had something crazy, crazy, crazy memorable about them. Ship fight with Zoltan Shield and hacking. Yeah, I'll take this. We need the extra scrap. Would have been one scrap short and extra salty. Yeah, I might have sold like a... Uh, Blackboard or something because cloaking is that important. Wow, these freaking ships today. Just unbelievable offensive setups on like 
every ship we're fighting except for two in this run. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's a seven power weapon system. Sector, what are we? Sector five. I guess that's not too far fetched, but it's just the fact that they have such good weapons. Uh, which one was the Pew Pew ship? Four basic lasers with 0.2 second cooldown. Um, well, I mean, I remember way back when I had the, the one that had the, um... Uh, Stormtrooper laser that was basically the basic laser that shot... But had terrible accuracy. That was a fun one. That was a Pew Pew ship, but I don't think that's the one you're talking about. Um, if you rearrange letters of clone bay and mind control, you could almost make cloaking. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's half power in this thing, too? Really, is it always half power in the dive? Is that a hyperspace thing? I don't like that change. I don't like it. You just Kestrel B, but basic laser cooldown was set to 0.2 seconds. This one, okay. Okay, yeah, I vaguely remember it. It was a, a 42 minute run. Well, you know, that was an OP ship. Let me, let me see it fire one time. And let's see here, let's see. Yeah, all right, that was a fun one. That was definitely a fun run for sure. All right, no shields for you. Backup battery doesn't even last long enough for artillery to fire once. Tell me again how good artillery is. Remind me again why artillery is ever good. So I can't. I really can't remember. I really I remember. I really can't remember right now why artillery is. Why anybody would think that would be useful. Oh yeah, it's not, because it sucks and it's a waste of a system. If I re ran to an auto scout with cloaking and a basic laser was funny. <laughs> yeah. They were able to actually fire this a crap ton of times too. Alright, 136 scrap. We have enough for cloaking almost. Let's go engine control. We're just looking for cloaking. Nian, cat artillery, that's then that and like some random flak artillery is like the only artillery that have ever been not just absolute crap. I'm pretty sure I've said this before, but artillery is either stupidly overpowered because somebody um, does that purposefully for a modded ship or just completely worthless. There's like no in between. There's no way to actually balance a thing, it seems like. God, we gotta go for missiles offline here because freaking this thing's gonna kill our. Just instantly take out. Nice. Instantly take out our Zoltan shields. We blocked the one perfectly. Good. That was like the ship where you gave Rand a 50 projectile flak one and all enemies had it too. Almost one shot me. Just rushed over the. Just rewatched the cloaking pew pew drone encounter. Yeah. I do. I do vaguely remember that actually. I do remember us having the ridiculous. Basic lasers, and then we actually ran into one ship with them, and I was like, oh my god, we're gonna die. What's the flat crew special ability? It's 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 on enemy ships. You can't use it on your own ship. It just does a flak shot to their room. I think it's like a single flak shot. It's like one damage to the room, I think. Alright, we have we have enough for cloaking. Come on, give me the cloaking. If we got cloaking, we're gonna be so OP. Um, I think I actually skip ship fights right now looking f making sure I see all of my jumps. Whoa, what is this sector layout? Holy crap. That is one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six forced jumps to actually get to the exit beacon. What a shitty sector. One, two, three, four. The store's down here. One, two, three, four, five. I would have to die of that. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I would die for a cloaking right now. 
I don't need fuel. No store. So one, two, three, four. Now it's one, two, three. One, two, three, four. Okay, the store could be there. God, what a shitty sector, man. Okay. So that is uh, one, two, three, four jumps, five jumps that I wasn't able to see if there's stores. Give me at least one store up here, please, game. Just one store with cloaking. And we'll call it even with this ridiculously bad sector layout. You're running. Okay, so we're going to hack your engines. Did I just hack shields? That is not what I meant to hack. That pull pilot? It does not, because I didn't hit the engine room. Okay. Just realized it was one year and two days ago that you followed on Twitch. Wow, how did you how did you realize that? There is like follow age stuff, but I don't know if any of my bots do that correctly. The new NG defense strategy make their sector navigation impossible. Yeah. Yeah, that's pulsar. Okay, still just enough for a cloaking. Back up better. Those two guys, okay. Alrighty, Pulsar, alrighty. Hmm. I'm gonna do this. At least we have plenty of drone parts. The one thing I really can't complain about is our drone parts. We have crap tons of them. Crap tons. Okay, you have no weapons, sir. You follow today? Well, welcome, unusual name tag. I'm uh, glad to have you here. Welcome to the stream. I hope you were prepared for salt. <laughs> You're watching on YouTube? Nice, nice. Welcome from the YouTube, my friends. Love getting the folks joining from the YouTubes. Looked at the Pew Pew video one year ago and you wondered how long ago you followed. Followed since October 7th, 2019. Well, how do you actually see that? Is that a U is that a Twitch command or is that... Does, does the bot give you that command? Or does Twitch actually track that now? Twitch itself actually has something that tracks that. Okay, get one shield back. Let's go. Come on. I got two more chances for a store this sector. Come on, NG sector. Don't please don't tell me there were three stores on the bottom there. Yeah, booby trap, that would be worthless. Okay, something to sell. Yes. Alright, store have cloaking, and I will be say this is the best layout I've ever seen of a sector. Your sector is the most beautiful and nobody could ever compare. Your sector sucks, and you should feel bad and I hate it. Where's the cloaking? Damn it. Your sector sucks. Learn to sector, noobs. Mmm. What? Rah. God damn it. I mean, I could get drone control with defense drone and a hole repair, but I don't want it. I don't want it. I want cloaking. We need to go... We haven't even seen a single uh, automated reloader either. Not... What What kind of flackening is this? What a clone bay. I actually think I'm going to have to buy a human right about now, actually. Actually, actually. I have no crew. I'm not going to have my control counter. Four crew is not enough crew, so... We're buying a frickin' human. We're actually doing it. See what you have made me do, NG Sector? See what you have made me do? You have made me buy a human. If that doesn't make you feel bad, I don't know what would. I don't know what would. Unbelievable. <laughs> I know, how dare I? How dare I buy a human? How dare I? Dishonor on you, on your family, and on your cow. <laughs> Especially your cow. Rock Homeworld Sector 7, well... 
Thank God, washing machine is fixed, replaced the heating element, and cleared the clogged drainage pump, and it started working again. If it wasn't that, it was replacing the whole drum next. Wow, Nietzsche. I wouldn't have done half of that work, so good on you. It's good on you. I'm going to check up here for a store. We have one goal. It's finding a store was with uh, cloaking. You hadn't done washing for a couple weeks, but not like that matters much at the moment. <laughs> oh, come on. All right, we got Clone Bay at least. All right. That was the, f if I hadn't just got clone bay, I had a two fifty fifties to lose a crew right there. So I think it's two fifty fifties, fifty fifties. Clone bay value point piloting here. We're staying, we're floating above 150 scrap for cloaking. You end up lowering the cost of drone control in your pack as a way to incentivize playing with drones more. Only a couple are any good at vanilla costing. I was wondering about that, actually. I was wondering about that. Oh my god, double missiles and four shields. I wouldn't have enough for cloaking if I take this deal. And it's not a free crew, so we're not doing it. We should one-shot a Zoltan shield, though. Good. It's good dodges. I have to go all in on weapons here. I mean on shields because of four shields. Okay. Alright, we'll be able to block one more missile, looks like. God, they... Oh, God. Please be a one damage missile. Yes! I take your offer! Okay, all right. Oh, thank goodness. All right. Free NG. I mean, free Zoltan. Yes. Yes, that's a good deal. Way better than paying for Zoltan. All right, two stores. So we can now go one, two, three. And I think you were only going to get two stores in this, so... Surely, surely. I'm not even going to say it. I'm not even going to say it. One, two, three, four. I just hope we get cloaking. That's what I'm going to say. I had a Zoltan point there, I was still fine. I had one point. I had one point. There's no guarantees in FTL. There are no guarantees. Never say you're fine in FTL. Never say it. Don't do it. Did I get the cloaking offline? Good. Don't call me Shirley. Okay, flak two offline. Now we're safe. Good. All right. Hey, we're actually hitting with it. It seems like with our uh our better weapon training, we're hitting our shots more often. I know it doesn't work that way, but it just kind of feels that way. You gotta go, Zoli. Have fun, and may the RNG be with you. God, I hope so. But thank you, Zoli. You have a great rest of your night, my friend. We'll see you next time. Is the artillery still 50 seconds at level 1? On this one, I don't think so. But it's weird because the charge bar doesn't change when the modder changes the charge time on it very well, I don't think. Does it say in here? Uh, 15 seconds at level 4. Which is not the 20 seconds that it shows there, so maybe it's 45. I don't I don't actually know what it is. What's so special about these guys that look like weapons? The flak crew? They're flak crew, that's what makes them special. Um, they basically have well here, I'll let you look at the stats. For those who haven't seen this before, it's the uh, the third time we played these. There are three versions of this ship. They have rock health. Uh, I think about rock speed. Uh they have Mantis damage to crew and double damage to systems, which is unique to them. And they take reduced suffocation fire damage. And their special ability deals damage from the inside. So their OP is what they are. They're super OP. Oh, there it is. Math Champ just gave the numbers. 37.5. So 37.5 at level 1 up to 15 at level 4. Okay. Okay. Got to make a new charge bar anytime you make a different time to already and it's a pain in the bottom. Oh, I'm not blaming you all for not doing it. Hope it didn't come across that way. Uh, it's just 
I can't tell. Uh, so. Hey, what's up, Jitterbug? How are you doing, sir? I had a blast with our uh, D and D yesterday. That was a lot of fun. Doreen, I feel like is doing a great job with uh, with the sessions. Uh, where shields? There it is. Oh God, he one shot, and we did not dodge very well. Okay. Uh, so that's my backup battery gone. Okay. I'm just gonna go straight for weapons here. Nice. You don't like my artillery, don't like my backup battery. Guess what? I don't like you. So we're even. You're doing well, it was a great session. Man, I've been really enjoying it. I feel like so... I almost feel a little guilty that I get to be the one streaming a session with people who are so good at the game, because I feel like you all are such experienced and good players. <laughs> and I'm getting carried by such experienced and good players. I just wish we had a little bit better viewership because I feel like the sessions are going so well and we have such a good group, so hopefully it'll grow as we do it more because I've been really enjoying the D&D one off. I need to resist it. I'm fitting in. Well, I appreciate that. I really appreciate it. It's been a lot of fun. Okay, good Dumble Doge. You're going to have to catch the D&D VOD. You missed time. You missed timed after Monster Train and missed the start. Yeah, and it's like one big long video. I'll be uploading it tomorrow to YouTube. Uh, but it's like one big long three hour fight. So, all right, Cloaking. We got two chances for it. I'm not like the typical new player. Well, I appreciate that. God damn it. Well, that's pre-igniter though. Um, I feel a little lucky though because I have Shogi's game that I've been able to play for a while. Um, you specialize in introducing the new player to D&D. You've seen quite a spectrum. Nice. I don't even know that I want pre-igniter, honestly. Flak ones, the thing that's so good about them being fast means their value with pre-igniter is not really high, especially when you have hacking to get through shields. I could afford it, but why? The value of it is so low, except in Zoltan shield fights. Is it even worth the scrap? I feel like it's... Honestly, I feel like it's not. I don't think it's worth. I'm going to repair once, and then we're going to check this other store, because we, again, are only looking for cloaking. <sighs> yeah, please offer me a goddamn med bay when I just sw swatched, swatched over to clone bay. I really wish they changed the way they do uh, system system rarities. It's so dumb. It's so dumb that they would offer me med bay over actual useful systems. Like teleporter? I mean, why? To absorb the hacking in phase one, I guess? Where's Pie Boy? How many stores can you get in Rock Home Worlds? I think I'd rather hope for store in sector 8 with clone bay then do that so only have six crew do that mind control did the other store have mind control i might just get mind control honestly i'm pretty sure this store have mind control i'm just gonna do that we still have mind control counter just no missile defense except zeldon shield Cloaking does not exist. It does not exist. Except as an illusion in my mind. Bored with my flax. Eh, I guess that could have been something, but. I have four flak ones. I don't want to board with my flax. I want to flak them with my flax, not flak them with my flax. Not board them with my flax. I want to flak them with my flax. You know, there's there's a difference there. I should put you in here so I can use my mind control offensively. The only time Ion Bomb is good when I actually have Zoltan Shield. Okay, get this off. God, I hope this missile doesn't hit me. Oh, 
Oh, okay. We had just enough Zoltan Shield for it. Uh, next seven jumps are event stores all with cloaking now. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, wouldn't, wouldn't even surprise me. Uh, you built a lanyard ship with only shields, engines, and weapons. The idea was that you should have all the systems in Ignoro to a medbay if you really wanted. It starts with four lanyards as well. Nice. So we need 190 scrap to get the last flak. So that's the last thing we're doing. Since cloaking is no longer a possibility, we are just trying to get flak now. Rock sectors should have two stores. All right, well, there were two next to each other, so that was pretty much our stores, I guess. I will hack weapons if it looks like that missile's gonna hit us, I think, is what we'll do here. Not that I need to save drone parts, but. If that, if that had hit, we actually took a missile hit. Missile shot. Nice. Has Rack ever seen has Rand? Has Rack ever seen a Fland? Has Rand ever seen a flat crew in any store? Uh is that possible? I don't think I have. System repair drone. A bad deal. But I probably don't find any more stores, so do I think I get more than 30 scrap from killing this guy? I think there's a chance of getting more scrap from killing him. Please be more than 30. Six extra, all right. You have them set as rarity five, that's why you see pirate ships with them occasionally. Oh, have I really? I don't know if I remember seeing that either. Yeah, let's get value point. We need uh, 19 more scrap. Get, can get them as free crew as well. Well, apparently I only get the rare stuff when I'm playing with uh, Scottish Pingu stuff, and not with your stuff, Math Champ. So much cloaking. God, if only I had cloaking, it'd be so nice right about now. Oh, that was really good dodges, though. Really stinking good. It was a little early, actually. That's okay. And with my control, so you can't repair, and then everything in the weapons. And okay, we took one damage there, not too bad. Please get before the cloak. Nice. Beautiful. There's a fire somewhere, but it's in an empty room, so it's got to be in one, two, or three rooms there. The ship, when you change your crew over to sensors, had a flat crew. Oh, did it? By the way, you can run into your... into your... I can run into your flagship and your viewership's attack mod. You've been talking about that for so long, I... am... Looking forward to, but also dreading playing your your viewership's attack mod, Math Champ. All right, uh, examine the station. ASB and intruders. What an interesting thing to have happen. Okay. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. Okay. Let's go. They're taunting me with their cloaking, yeah. My god, this cloaking sure is nice. Look how invisible we are right now. God, you're just taunting me. It's so mean. So nice and cozy in this invisible shell we've created. All right, well, we have a flackening. No, no automator reloaders. Nothing else special. We'll try to get... I mean, I, I feel like I need to actually get fourth shield, but I would rather get my flak artillery upgraded, so... Sec rate store is cloaking. <laughs> I keep like reaching for C is like I'm gonna cloak this missile and then I realize damn it. Cloaking does not exist. 
Cloaking is a pipe dream. Cloaking is a figment of our imagination. Here comes the missile. Yeah, two damage. Ha! <laughs> Guess what's the only weapon that stays online? Get that out of here. That's right. Get that crap out of here. Thank goodness he didn't get another shot off. Your hyperspace tuned down scrap ward in Sector 1. You seem to see a lot more, lots more single-digit wars than you remember before. Not that you're aware of. God. That would be weird. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't want hyperspace to make any balance changes at all. Give even even the hyperspace fix, I don't understand that. I don't understand why they did that. If the monitors of hyperspace are just trying to make it so that you can get into the code, why would did they do that because that's what they felt the original um Developers intended that it was not intended to work that way. All right, so I want that for this. Okay, slowly level up our artillery and more power. I mean, I feel like that's not what hyperspace is trying to do to rebalance. They're not trying to be like the FTL balance mod or whatever, which I never liked because they were doing things like making good weapons worse and worse weapons better, but not actually make them, not making it in a way that seemed to had any actual balance. You agree that the default should just leave everything vanilla because adding the ability to do second seated runs along with quality life visual stuff like the whole numbers? Yeah, I feel like they just, they just shouldn't mess with balance maybe maybe they do a second thing that's hyperspace balance patch or something but it seems like hyperspace what they're trying to do with it is rebalance FTL and if they start coming up with their own idea of what FTL balance is it's just I don't know think that hard sector one and sector two are supposed to be the same rewards all right well in vanilla, you think? Well, I've committed to not going fourth shield here. Uh, need the level two sensors to be able to use this. We should do a heist and have everyone involved in it. Even oh, you're talking about the uh, <laughs> chat heist, yeah. Do I even get level three hacking? I'm all I'm honestly thinking about hacking piloting. Because I can't get both. Well, let's see. Okay, there's an extra ship fight here. Maybe we can get level three hacking and level three artillery, possibly. Alright, let me guess. We're gonna leave only the missile up when I when I hit here. Oh, it was the first one to go down because it just fired. Perfect. I think the balance stuff came from them working so close to the multiverse guys and the view they have of the game. I so completely disagree with multiverse devs idea of what's balanced FTL for the simple fact that they're balancing on normal mode. I really hope I really hope they make a change to that. But maybe multiverse just won't be something I play, so. Often features added to hi hyperspace specifically from the multiverse devs requesting it. Uh, okay. All right, 145 scrap. Um, if I do that, I have exactly one power. Okay, all right, all right, we'll do that. Backup battery, great. I love one more power, but this is okay. This is okay. Most of it, that is extra stuff that doesn't affect vanilla, like custom beacon markers or custom crew features, etc. Yeah. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. This is what this ship is. <laughs> I forgot it's the 
The rebel flagship. The rebel flagship. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's the rebel flagship. Wow, they only hit one shot. Here comes all the flax. And their flax are. Oh, that was one of the best flax hits I've seen. And he hacked my pilot. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's pretty bad. Nice. Your cloaking means nothing to me. These are all the same weapons, so we just fire at the room we're most likely to hit, which is, I think, shields. Hey, our flak artillery actually did get to fire once. Nice. Got just enough upgrades in it to not be completely worthless. Overwhelming offense is the best defense, that's right. What is this abomination? <laughs> it's a flak versus a flak flak flak. Flak versus flak. Who will win? The flak? The flakening or the flak ship? Alrighty then. 20 scrap. Can't get anything. Uh, yes, I want extra scrap. Let's go up here. Do, 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 do. We got a missile. Let's go ahead and do this. Just because you have just because you have a missile, we're doing this. I think we destroyed the missile with our flax. Get flacked, missile. Oh guys got hacking. He hacked my hacking, that's fine. Holy crap, a weapon floating in space. That's also a ship. <laughs> What's the theme of this ship, Kappa? I don't know, it's hard to tell. I, don't, I can't really tell what the theme of this ship is. Like at the tip of my tongue. The Zoltan, Zoltan Borders. That's what it is. Zoltan Borders. Can I do this, this, and a power? No. So let's do this. Do this. Now we can have mind control online, and maybe we can have, I don't know, level two uh, the mind control value point before three, phase three. Missile ships are all the rage this, this this season. Missile ships, they're so hot right now. Do, 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 do. Does he have a defense drone? He does. It's off the screens for so long that I can't tell the timing. There it is. Scoop, doop, 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 doop. Hey, we killed one of his drones. That's nice. One shot of shields. Got some crew kills. His drone control. Woo! I've played your flagships three times now, and never has their enemy flak felt as strong as it has this time. I must have gotten four shields for every other time I fought this ship. Four ships or cloaking. And... Me investing in the artillery this time. This this is feeling like a pretty low score, honestly. This is so scary, I know. This is... I mean, just, just how... <laughs> I, I don't know if maybe my dodge is lower than previous attempts on this ship or what. Okay, 43 stuff so I can get mind control value. All right. <laughs> this score will be 5135 is your guess. All right. I would not be surprised if we didn't break 5k. Not be surprised, not the slightest. Now it looks like a ship that's smaller than ours after all the pieces have fallen off. 13 lucky scrap. God, I hope it's lucky. Uh, I don't actually want to use mind control offensively, so let's move here. My flax better than your flax. Mm, maybe not. Okay. Okay. Do I care about you humans being there? Not too much. We'll do this. Alright, this should be GG right here. 
Whoa, what was that loud popping sound? I think one of our flax maybe shot... Is shot down or something? I'm not sure. All right, one more volley. Oh, but mind control's gonna happen. Okay, it's good. And... Flack you, flagship! GG cookie time, we got there. The third and final of the flagships. This one called the flackening. The flagship flackening. From Map Champ. What? What a salty couple of runs we've had today, man. RNG has not been good. Do my flax bring all the boys to the yard? They're like, they're better than yours. Absolutely. Let's check the score. I feel like it's going to be low, but I'll probably be wrong. Okay, 5206. Better than I thought, and Explosive Ash was actually not too far off. Oh, man. What a, what a challenging couple of runs. I know MathChamp said he designed the ship to be challenging at the start. I feel like it shouldn't have been as bad as it was. Um, just because there's so many missile ships today. And really insane weapons on all our enemies. Alrighty, my friends. We have time for one more ship, I believe. Well, one more if it's not stupid fast. So, I believe there's some ships from Rad82. It's an unbalanced ship mod pack. Maybe I can get two of those in if they're, like, really unbalanced towards the player. But I'm going to stand up, stretch, use the restroom, take my final break of the day. Thank you all so much for watching. If there's anybody new to the stream, I hope you're having a good time. Please do the follow. We will do at least one more run, possibly two, depending on how it goes. So, y'all rock. I'll see you in just a bit, my friends.